Hey guys, Carrie here. Hey, this is totally a different video than what I usually do. It was totally awesome, and I have to share it with everybody. I went to heaven for a few seconds, probably 20 seconds. So it happened about two weeks ago at Bikram Yoga class. I'm doing the usual poses. Um, the first pose is half moon pose. You go to both sides, you do a back bend and a forward bend. Well, I was coming out, I don't remember coming out of the second back bend, the second, the second time of the first series. Um, all I remember is looking down and I could see over everybody in the room, but there was a paper thin cloud line, a very symmetric white bright cloud line, and it was a very, very bright white room. Um, the feeling I had was very euphoric, almost orgasmic. My whole body was shaking. Uh, the yoga teacher told me from down below my cloud, I guess. Um, and I was moving forward, but there was a pressure on the back of my head. I think that was telling me to come back. It's not my time yet. But I can't totally verify that, but there was definitely a pressure on my head saying, or being told that I need to come back down. So while I was up there, it was just incredible. Had I had the chance to stay up there and make a decision on the spot, I think I would have chose to stay up there. That is how awesome heaven was. And I mean, I don't have a bad life and my life is getting better, but still, I mean, this was just an awesome feeling and I wasn't really making my own decisions at the time anyway. So when I came back down, I didn't know where I was at all. It took me maybe 20 seconds to even realize, oh, I'm at yoga class and everybody's bending forward. So I know I was up there for about 20 seconds. Um, oh, and I wasn't dehydrated. I go to Bikram a lot. I've done the 60 day challenge. I've done a lot of the other challenges. So that wasn't it at all. But when on my way out, after I'd finished the whole series, I finished the whole class and I was just kind of like in awe. I couldn't figure out what had happened or what was going on. I was just like, oh my gosh, I had this really out of body experience. I don't know if you guys ever watched the 2020 they aired years ago where they were talking about near-death experience and somebody had actually put a shoe up real high where only people that saw over would be able to see the shoe. But let me tell you, there was this fine line of white cloud. I would not have been able to see under the cloud at all. So that theory probably wouldn't have worked in my case. I just know it was a higher power. So on my way out, I asked the yoga teacher, I said, hey, did you ever like not know where you are at all during this series and she's like no no I had never had that feeling so I come home and there's an email from my mother that my uncle died at that exact second it was just totally crazy I know this was a higher power I'm not sure if he was leaving and I was just getting a small taste or something but the thing is I'm not close at all with his uncle I've only seen him maybe 10 times in my life he is my dad's brother but I didn't know him well I mean I always thought he was a nice guy when I saw him but um, it just didn't really know him that well, but everybody says we must be spiritually connected, even though we weren't connected in this lifetime. I don't know, I guess that makes sense, but, oh, a couple other people said maybe I had a kundalini experience, but I don't know, because I don't think you see over your body during that. But anyway, this was like the most euphoric thing ever. I mean, it was like my whole body was shaking, it was like... I, I just can't explain it, and had I had a chance at the time, I probably would have stayed there. It was just that neat of a feeling, that neat of an experience, and, you know, I used to be so scared of dying, but I'm not afraid anymore. So somebody described dying um, that had a near-death experience as coming home. I don't know that I'd see that, but it was still pretty cool. But anyway, thanks for watching. Share your suggestions. If, um, if you've ever had anything like this, please let me know. Kind of cool for conversation. Also, it took me about a week to settle back into my reality after this whole thing. Um, I just didn't want to work, but then again, well, who does? But, you know, I just couldn't settle back into everything. I couldn't get my hat back on straight. <laughs> um, I also think that we need to do more with our lives. We need to help people. We need to make it a better place because ultimately we're only here a short time and then we are either turned to dust or six feet under. Okay, guys. Thanks. Have a great night. Aloha.